a mysterious site in China's far western lands of Xinjiang. Driving through the mountains, then downwards, Cheng Shoujun takes us to a plant that's been running for decades, but remains largely unknown to the outside world. For Cheng, the facilities at the station are more than familiar. But when he began his career here 30 years ago, the underground plant was a top secret. It provided electricity for mining projects at a crater 10 kilometers away. The pit was known for its abundance of rare metals, sourced in the 1960s for China's development of the atom and hydrogen bombs. Mining has been suspended, but the minor stories of past times continue to inspire those at Koko Tohai. Chang says the spirit of Koko Tohai is kept alive by remembering the legacy of past generations. Today, generators are still spinning. The hydroelectric station is still providing power to the towns nearby. It no longer has a national security function, but the plant is still here, a memory of generations and beyond. Zhao Yunfei, CGTN, Kekotohai, Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region.